Great news about Percy Thrower, that. Get well soon, Percy. And that electric guitar thing, I really enjoyed that in Bloopy today. Now, on the subject of the little I setter here, on the... Oh, you're going to drive it now. It's taking him all afternoon to decide to drive that thing today. It's not often that we get so much interest in a little piece of the set. Somebody sent it to us, and they said, Andy, it was either coming to you or going to the dog. Well, thanks very much. And it's been on there, and people have written in and said, you know, can we have it? Where do you get it from? No idea, I'm afraid. But I must just say thank you to Nigel Goimer, who is the chairman of... Look at this. The Isetta Owners Club of Great Britain. And they've sent me this rather smart sweatshirt, so thank you very much indeed for that. Now, come here. I need to talk to you about Comet Relief confidentially. Come here. If you weren't here earlier on this afternoon, you won't know that the boats have to be in by Tuesday, because we're going to announce the chart on Wednesday, Thursday, Friday of next week. And I was told earlier on today that I'm now leaning again, so please, vote for Mr. Bronson. Don't vote for me. I mean, there's no reason why I should go in the junk tank. I think Mr. Bronson is the man you should vote for. We've seen him on Grange Hill. <coughs> we've, we've seen... Oh. You. Mr. Boy. Bulldozer, or whatever your name is. It's, uh, it's, it's Crane, Mr. Crane. Bronson, sir. sir. Yes, sir. Your viewers will know that I took my dunking last Tuesday. I do not intend to be dunked again. No, no, sir, no. no. I think, therefore, I shall remain here. Make sure you behave yourself. <clears throat> yeah, as well, as I was saying, if you want to vote for me... You, uh, boys and girls, you will not vote for me on February the 5th. You will vote for Crane. <sighs> yes. F thank you, Mr. Bronson. Um, <clears throat> well, I'm just going to do tomorrow's menu very quickly. Uh, we'll be back tomorrow at 10 to 4 with Corners, followed by Super Ted. At uh, 4.15, there's Gaffer Samson's Luck with Christopher Guard, and then at 4.30, we've uh, Survival Challenge with my namesake, Richard Crane, who will be joining me live in the broom cupboard, as Mr. Bronson is doing at the moment. Uh, 5 to 5, there's News Round Extra, all about Australia, and then at 10 past 5, that fantastic programme, I've always said, Grange Hill. And with your permission now, Mr. Bronson, sir, I, I have to say goodbye to uh, people watching in Wales. They will not escape that easily. You, you will vote for Crane. Bye-bye, Wales. Uh, <clears throat> for those of us that remain, we, Mr. Bronson, we're, we'd be interested to know if, if you will be involved in, in comic relief at all. I travel to Manchester this Saturday to compare a fun run. Fun? <laughs> yes. Mr. Bronson, do you not think that perhaps is um, and sort of the wrong word for someone su such as you? No, perhaps it isn't after all. <laughs> I felt so awkward here before. <clears throat> we will be back tomorrow, as I say, at, at 10 to 4. Ha have a lovely evening. Just before I go, there's, there's something I've always, I've always wanted to do. We didn't tell him this. Mr. Bronson, happy comic relief. Bye-bye. <laughs>